everyone, my name is Christ and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is 26th chapter, Elijah helped the family. It didn't rain for a very long time. The curtain river dried up. The people didn't have enough food. The crops didn't grow well. So, yes, you see, there are no rain for several, uh, several years. So, like, the land didn't have not have water so the plants didn't grow well where shall I get food to eat prayed Elijah go to the pot and window will take care of you there. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> so like one day Elijah like asked to God that mm, where should I get the food? Elijah went to the pot. When Elijah went into the town gate, a window was gathering sticks. Elijah said to her, "Can I have some water and bread?" So, as Scott said, there was one. There were windows. So like. He asked to the woman that can I have some food and water. Let's see what the, she says. <laughs> the woman said, my son and I only have enough food, flour, and oil for one last meal. Elja replied, Don't worry, prepare food. Bring me the bread to me first, then cook something for you and your son. So, the woman said, like we don't have enough food to have only like only have enough flour. My son and I only have enough flour and oil for the last meal. She said, like, and suddenly Elisa was saying, like, first make me bread. Let's see what does she does. God will not let you ha go hungry until it rains. Your flour and oil will never run out. The woman did as Elisa said. Elisa, the woman, and her son had enough food to eat. After that, God took care of the woman and her son through son Elisa. So she has made the bread, the meal, and like, and.
and as Ellie just said, we woman until it rains. Warmest flower and oil was never run out. The woman thanked Elijah for giving her f- enough food. Elijah thanked the woman for the food too. Twenty-seven. A room for Elijah. Um, that chapter was Elijah, and this chapter will be Elijah. <laughs> Elisha often traveled to the town of Sherman. Please eat with us. Then you pass when you pass our house. A Sherman woman said to Elisha, "I know that you work for God. We want to help you." Elisha was preaching God's words. So, Eliza preached the God's world word. So, um, a woman living in Sherman wanted Eliza to come with them and pass their house and eat with. Them. The woman and her husband went to help Elisha. They invited him for a dinner. Elisha liked to eat with them. Elisha knew they loved God. So, they have ate dinner together. The sh- woman prepared something wonderful for Elisha. She asked her husband to make something for Elisha. Come this way. So the woman prepared something for Elisha, and she asked his husband to make it. Let's see what is it. Oh. <laughs> The woman took Elisha to a nice room. There, there was a bed, a table, and a chair. Even a lamp was there. We made this room just for you. Whenever you are here, you can sleep in this room. So. So she made a room, a nice room, a window, a lamp. Um, a silver lamp, electric, electricity lamp. I don't know why there is there. Maybe this will be a candle. Mm. Oops. <laughs> Elisha was happy to see the room. It was a comfortable room. Thank you. You have prepared everything for me in this room," said Elisha. Sorry again. My pen. We are proud that you work for God. We are happy to help you," said the woman. Yesterday, I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy? The next time, I'll read another good story. Then, let's see you next time. Bye.